Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg and I'm standing in front of a 66 Mustang convertible. And this baby is beautiful and you're gonna love checking it out. So go to the website at vanguardmotorsales.com. We'll put it on the lift so you can see just how nice the bottom side is. We're gonna take a look under the hood. We're gonna look at that black interior. We'll even open up the trunk. We're gonna put the top up. We're gonna go out and drive it. We're gonna show you everything you wanna see so you can make a great decision on your Mustang investment. So come on up and we'll fire it up for you now. Look at this beauty, man. That red paint is popping and it is smooth. The body works amazing. I tell you, that hood is flat as a board. The chrome is shining. That pony looks like it's brand new. The grill looks great. Now the hood's fitting nice and flush too. And I tell you what, that line is nearly perfect. We've got style steel uh, hubcaps on it. These are the ones that actually look like wheels. You know how I know that? When I was a kid, I put a lug wrench on one of those and broke it off. <laughs> White wall tires, Mustang emblem looks good. The door fits real good. Our gap there looks good. The stainless is in good shape. You've got the normal wear you normally have on the top piece of stainless here from the convertible top, but it looks fantastic. 1966, guys. Look at that door jam. She's beautiful. Now the door panel here, you'll notice there's a little bit of texture in it. Now Ford Motor Company did that. That texture is actually in the metal. Door panel looks good, carpeting looks great, and yep, that's an air conditioner, guys. That's the way they used to do air conditioning back in the day in these, and it does work. That dash itself is in beautiful shape. Steering wheel looks to be original. The dash pad itself is in good shape. Back seat looks good. I see some seat belts back there. The boot fits over the convertible top nice. It is a vinyl convertible top. If you want to check out the pictures, you'll be able to see pictures of that top up. Paint back here looks great. Tail light bezels look good. Chrome on the back bumper looks good. That gas fill cap looks new. And look at that, I had five keys to choose from and got the first one. We got a spare tire in there and that's a cool Mustang uh, hubcap there. The gutters here are all nicely painted. The bottom side of the deck lid's nicely painted. The inner wheelhouses are painted. Back sides of the quarters are painted up. Look at that, even the trunk floor looks good. And this all looks original to me. That's where the uh, frame's welded on right there. You can see the spot weld still. Nice clean car here, guys. You don't find these little Mustangs clean because you know what? People drove these babies. They love these cars. They drove the wheels off of them. Convertible Mustang, and it's red. Now, at Vanguard Motor Sales, we're not consignment dealers. That means we own all of our inventory here. We spend the time to check it out before we buy it. When we get them back here to the shop, we go through them so we can answer any questions you have. Now we buy about 40 cars a month and I'm involved in buying every one of those cars. So what that means to you is you're getting my 35 plus years messing around with old muscle cars, helping you pick out your dream car. All right, let's take this convertible for a ride. 66 Mustang, man, this thing is a blast. Top goes down, she's red, and she drives smooth as can be. Like I said earlier in the video, one of the reasons you don't see a lot of these cars is because people ran the wheels off of these cars because they were so fun to build. I actually saw a TV show about them this weekend on uh, I think Velocity or whatever, about them building the Mustang. 
Mustang was killing it back then and it's still killing it today because these are probably our most popular sellers here, these little Mustang convertibles. They're fun to just hop in, go to the car show, go out for ice cream, go to dinner, whatever you want to do. You can see it's driving nice, no hands on the wheel, going nice and straight, just as smooth as can be. And you know what? Tom can deliver this car to you anywhere in the world. You just give him a call at 248-974-9513 and he'll tell you how easy it is to park this dream in your drive. And if you need some help with financing, we got two bankers we work with, 10, 15 minute phone call and you're all set. Now look down here on the dash. All the gauges down here are working. The speedo's working, the amp gauge, the coolant, uh, oil pressure, and the gas. The horn's working. The air conditioning works. Yeah, that's the way they used to do air conditioning back in the day. But I tell you what, it's simple and it works great. If it gets too hot out, you just put the top up, turn the air on, and you're still having a blast. Now we're right outside the Motor City. We're only 20 minutes from the airport, so if you'd like to come visit us, check out our inventory. Right now we've got about 240 cars. We're only 20 minutes from the airport. We actually sent a guy down there to the airport. We'll pick you up. If you want to drive in on a Saturday or something, no problem there either. We're here till three o'clock. Just look how nice and smooth this baby drives. What a sweet ride. Now we're going to do something now that nobody else in the industry does. We're going to put this car up on the lift and we're going to check out the underside. We're going to pop the hood, take a look at the power. We're going to show you everything you need to see so you can make a great decision. All right, we're underneath this Mustang now and this convertible is beautiful underneath too. You can see they put a new gas tank in it. The drop downs look good. This is one of the things I look at on every one of these cars. You can just reach your hand up in there and a lot of times these cars you can just put your hand right through them. These drop downs look great. Now also take a look at the springs here where they mount to the frame. The frame looks good. You can see it's got a brand new exhaust system. It's a stock appearing um, exhaust system too and they've welded all the joints here so you don't have to worry about any leaks. Now the guys will pull the brakes apart make sure they're in good working order. We got a Ford 8 inch rear which is what would have came in this car. Uh, right around a 280 gear in there and it is an open rear end. Um, also on these Mustangs you want to look at this area in the frame too. Obviously this one looks great because you know what we got the lift sitting on it. Um, Take a look at the pinch welds on the car, the floorboards here. Now they've been undercoated, but they're nice and solid. Nothing wrong with those at all. Uh, the front frame up here, also another place to look at on these Mustangs. This frame looks nice and solid, nice and clean under here. We got a C4 transmission. It is period correct. It is not the original numbers matching transmission, but it is also what would have come in the car and it's a similar year. Now on the brakes, we'll pull all the brakes apart, make sure they're in good working order. Um, everything under here is nice and clean. Uh, you can see all the hoses look good, all the wiring looks good, bottom side of the motor's nicely painted. Um, it's just a beautiful car under here, guys. You don't see very many of these Mustangs like this. Like I said, I think I said it earlier in the video, people drove these cars because these things were a blast. Now let's look at wheels and tires. All right, up front here, we got some white walls. Uh, let's see, 195, 17, or 195, 75, 14 s Now these are hubcaps and they look like good looking, those style steel rims, but those are hubcaps. So you gotta pull that hubcap off and take the lug nuts off underneath. These are fakies. Um, look at that paint work right down to the bottom edge. Always feel around the bottom side here. I don't feel any patchwork in there whatsoever, so you know that's good solid metal. That rocker molding also looks original to the car. That tells you this car was very well kept for that rocker molding to still look that nice. Let's look at the rear. All right, out back here, we got 195, 75, 14s also. And again, this lip here, you wanna feel this lip, that where that inner wheelhouse goes to the quarter, it feels nice and clean. Also, take a look at the bottom side of these rockers. That's actually a factory hole in there to let moisture out. And again, that rocker molding looks good and the paintwork right down to the bottom edge is beautiful. Let's get under the hood. 
All right, under the hood here, we've got a 289. It's actually a, uh, the motor was cast in 64, so it's pretty close to period correct. It does have the uh, auto light two barrel carb, just like what it came from the factory. Uh, the car is equipped with air conditioning. Uh, the distributor looks period correct also. Everything under here is nicely painted. All the braces are here that Ford Motor Company put in. Somebody's actually put an auto light top on the battery here. That's just a fakie top. It's got a maintenance free battery underneath. Um, it's even got an auto light, um, dis uh, not distributor, that's the alternator, the distributor's over there. Um, the radiator looks like it's brand new. It's got the original style master cylinder that came from the factory. Uh, fuel pump looks like it's been all cleaned up. Just a beautiful example here, guys. And you always got to look at these um, inner wheelhouses here on these Mustangs. That's an important spot to look at on every one of these Mustangs and those uh, shock towers also. Beautiful paint on the bottom side of the hood. It's a gorgeous car, guys, and the top goes down. Give us a call at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales park this dream in your drive.